morning everybody. So in case you hadn't guessed, we are inside because of the rain. It was only last week where I was saying, oh, we might have to move the class till nine because it's too cold, it's too hot and now look what I've done, so it's my fault. So yes, we're just a minute or so early, so I shall let everybody get on. So everything today is uh, low impact friendly. I will probably give you some high impact cues if you want them. Um, Oh, Libby's in. Hi Libby, first one this morning. So yeah, I will give you high impact cues if you want them, but obviously we're indoors, so everything will be low impact today, but I promise we will all still get a good sweat on. So I am landscape for views. Zen's just gonna be kind of hovering in the background. Good morning, Libby. <laughs> okay, so we'll give everybody another minute. I imagine with the weather, it's been hard for everyone to get out of bed. Alex and Tom are in. So, as always, a five minute warm up. So, oh, how else have we got? Oh, people, people, yes, excellent. Right, let's get going. So, we're just going to start with a squat and reach. So, squat back, reach up. So, if you're ready, you can come straight up onto your toes. If you're not, just keep your feet down. So, really pushing your hips forward at the top. Bum back, chest forward. Just getting a good opener through the chest. Yeah, so Zan said, oh, should we put the fan on? I was like, no, not cold. So yeah, now, now I'm too hot. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we're going to do a step back lunge. Twist towards that bent leg. Stand back up to the top. Change legs. So it doesn't need to be really deep right now. You can see mine is quite a shallow lunge. Just working my way into it, waking up through the body. So in case you missed the start, obviously we're indoors because of the rain. So everything is low impact friendly, but I promise we're still gonna get a really good workout. You're still gonna leave sweaty. Okay, a few more. Last one. Okay, walk to the back of your mat, or just give yourself some space. You're gonna walk out into a plank, walk back to your toes. So really brace your core here. Try and start with the opposite hand as you come forward. Knees can be as bent as generously as you need. And then next time you're out in tall plank, you're going to do really slow hip dips. So you're going to come down, look towards your feet, come back through centre, over to the other side. So you're getting a good stretch through the side body, waking up through the core. So everybody at home, pop some music on. Keep it going. Last one. And then you're going to go up to down facing dog. So any way you like, I'll go from my knees up. And again, just pedal through the feet here. Waking up through the backs of the legs. So we're just mobilizing our muscles. And then you're going to step one foot up, doesn't matter which. Open up through the chest. Step it back down facing dog. And then alternate. So go at your pace. Making sure you're trying to lift your chest up towards the sky. So this is kind of a cardio based workout, but we've got some resistance elements in today. You're going to do one more each side. So last one. Okay, so you're going to walk back to your hands, and a bit keen there. <laughs> so move your feet if you need to. Okay, so we're just going to start rotating through the torso. So you're going to do side pushes. So really push strongly through the heel of the palm. As you can see, I'm rotating, coming up onto the heel. Keep it going. You can start picking up the pace a little bit.
seconds on, 15 seconds rest. I'm going to give you tons of modifications. So this is suitable for anybody that can bear weight on their hands and on their feet. So five more seconds here. Okay, rest. So format today, we're going to do one exercise, then another, then repeat. Xander's turning the fan on. <laughs> so we're going to start in a plank. So you're going to be on your knees or on your toes, and we're going to punch forward. So you're going to punch forward, alternating. So we're starting in 10 seconds. So if you're on your knees, push your bum down to make it a little bit harder. Otherwise, if you're on your toes, push your heels back. Three, two, one, off we go. Make sure in whichever variation you're doing, you're not locking your arms out going to be really difficult not to do. Keep breathing here. 10 seconds. We have quite a few cardio kickboxing elements. Okay, come on to your bums. We're going to do a sit up with a jab cross. So, bring the sit up, jab cross to the outside of your knees. So I'll just do it again. Three, two, one, up we go. So up you come. It's kind of a diagonal punch. Breathe out, you come up. Now if your feet are flying up off the floor, it's absolutely fine. 10 seconds. your toes, you'll lift your bum up, and we're going to do toe reaches. So, you can't reach your toe, shin, knee, doesn't matter. Three, two, one, off we go. Everybody try and focus on keeping your bum up off the floor, and move as quickly as you can. So heart rate will go up here, but it is a body strengthener. 15 seconds.
stitches. So we just had a little pause here. So we repeat these two and then we have a longer rest. Five, three, two, one, off we go. So it's, it's kind of nice when we have to stay inside because it can prove to you that you don't need to jump around to do a hit session. It's just a format. You could do it with weights, anything. Okay, eight seconds, come on. Let's go. Okay, bums down. Pregnant ladies, you're gonna come out, up, out, up. Otherwise, we're doing our crunches. Now, if you need to use your neck hammocks, interlace your fingers with your thumbs out. Three, two, one, off we go. Think about the quality of the movement here. Trying to move as much as you can. Tailbone, scooping up. Lower back is flush with the mat or the floor. Got no idea how tempting it is to tickle Zan's feet. <laughs> Keep it going. And rest. Okay, grab a drink if you want to. I suggest just little sips of water. Okay, I will demonstrate our next two. Just sort my mic out. Okay, so option one. You're going to jump back to a burpee, in, hold. So it's a squat, hold. Otherwise, you're going to step back, in, two pulses. Other side steps back, in, two pulses. Then here comes our cardio kickboxing. Three uppercuts, two, three, jab, cross. I will demonstrate that one again when we get there. So burpee, squat, hold, coming at you. In five seconds. Three, two, one. Off we go. Make sure you're coming up off the hands. Roll down softly. Then if you're not doing two legs, you're gonna step back. In, pulse low. Alternating feet. For 10 seconds. Added the pulse in when I didn't need to. <laughs> Five. Okay, come on up. So, one foot back. Forward hand is your jab hand. So, back hand. One, two, three. Jab, cross. Three, two, one. Up we go. One, two, three. Jab, cross. So, your time. Really good for the upper body. Make sure you're activating through the torso for those uppercuts. So the image is coming down to up. You feel a little bit silly, I can promise you you're not alone. Three. Rest. So we go back through. Just keep the feet moving, five seconds. Three, two, one, off we go. Make sure you're taking the weight out of your hands, extending all the way back, even if you're stepping. 15 seconds. Again, 
So you're one of those things that you might be a bit self-conscious about. But always remember, you're just at home. I'm on camera. So if I can do it, you can do it too. Okay, so we're doing a ladder squat now. So one, then two pulses. Three, you get the gist. Now, if you want to add in a jump, you do so. So come side on, off we go. So you would come up for that jump squat there. Now, move quickly. Bum is back. Try and keep your knees in line with your ankles. So you're just going up in those pulses. Five seconds. Okay, one foot forward. We're gonna go jab, jab, cross, kick, back foot, kick. Jab, jab, cross, kick, kick. Okay, off we go. Front hand, two jabs and across, two kicks. Now if you wanna challenge yourself, you can do the double kick without putting your foot down. So just keep saying it to yourself. Hook, 
hook, duck to that knees. Again, say it to yourself. You can always hop on that front foot as you drive the knee in. Make sure you're ducking. So a punch is coming your way. Ooh. <laughs> Stepped on my towel. Almost disastrous. Three. Rest. Walk out, do hip dips. You okay? You know when you almost fall over and you're like, Ooh. I don't fall, it's fine. Five seconds. Three, two, one, up we go. You got a pedal for me, go out, take with you. <laughs> Remember, you can cut out the hip dip if you want to. Try and alternate which hand starts first. Strong core here, strong back. Come on, five. And rest. Ooh. Opposite foot forward. So outer hand, hook, hook, duck. Two back knees. My towel is well out of the way. <laughs> Two, one, here we go. So you're really feeling it down your side body as you do those hooks, twisting really powerfully. 15 seconds. Okay, so we will need my towel back. We're all gonna be in a downward facing dog. So bum up, feet, just about shoulder width apart, you're going to tap the outside of your leg wherever you want to. Off we go. So it could be nice and low, could just be the outer edge of your thigh. Look towards your toes everybody. Now try and think about keeping everything to the midline. So what I mean by that is that centre line through you, so you're not twisting too much. Yeah. 
piece of work, we should have a work floor, so. Mm. 45 seconds. Okay, pop squats is next. So you're either gonna tap down as you jump out, up, down, up. So you, we're doing this one because you can be nice and light. Otherwise, you're gonna go out, up, out, up. Your choice. And then I'll do these two. So reverse elbow, one, two, duck, two kicks. Again, I will do that when we get there. Pop squats first. Five seconds. Three, two, one, up we go. So land gently, otherwise you're tapping out, center, out, center. Your choice. So you're hopping, I like to think it's called a pop squat because you pop up like a piece of toast. <laughs> and whatever gets you through, Hannah, that's what everyone's thinking. <laughs> Three. <laughs> okay, so back foot, two elbows, really rotating. Then we go back with a duck, then back foot kicks. Five. Three, two, one. So two elbows, duck, kick, kick. So really rotate again. Elbow is coming as high as your nose. So again, that's going to be good core control to swivel around. Five. Okay, pop squats again. Just keep moving. Your hips are high. Woo. 
and up. Okay, opposite foot forward. If you can't remember, you will quickly after you've started. Lunge and kick. I'm just gonna move this quickly. I can see it happening again. Two, one, we go. So remember, you've got the options to tap, kick and tap before you go back. Working on all levels here. So it will, if anybody has come in late, this will be available after on my IGTV and also on YouTube. Okay, side plank. So we're going to go the opposite way. So I'm going to do a little spin. So left hand into centre this time. So we're all going to start in that kickstand. So one foot in front. Off we go. So under, up. Now if you want to, start with the step. Hips are high, so push them up. Most important thing here. Then after that, it's the reaching under. 10 seconds. Keep it going, come on. Full body strengthener. And rest. Have a quick wipe. So, have a little drink. We've got two groups to go. <laughs> Send is actually, it's dripping off his nose. triceps yesterday. Okay. So, Sam, are you doing your hamstrings? Yeah. So, Sam is going to be with my pregnant ladies. I will be on my back. Five, three, two, one. Now, everybody with me, nail your lower back down. It's your shoulders that are up off the mat. Doesn't matter whether you're touching your toes, your heels, 
or nowhere near. Just that action of sliding back and forth. Nine seconds. Five. Oh, the sun's out. <laughs> Rest. Okay, we're all doing runners now. So one foot back. You're just gonna come up and down as quickly as you can. Now we're all gonna lean over. Three, two, one. Now if this gets too much, just come up. But stay over as long as you can. So we're not lunging back, it's just tapping down. We're going for speed. Ow, my friend like. 10 seconds, come on. Five. Okay, again, pregnant ladies, you stay up. Everybody else, come on down. Now we're creating an X shape. So lean out, opposite hand, opposite leg. You're gonna go toes, knee. Off we go. Toes, knee. You guys are gonna do the same thing, stood up. So you can balance if you want to, or tap down. So really think about control. And again, everybody take up space. As wide as you can go. I'll just stay here. <laughs> Five. Okay. Other side on runners. Which leg did I have there? You'll remember. Yeah, I will remember. <laughs> Three, two, one. Off we go. Mm, I think it was that one. I don't know. <laughs> half each side so if you're with me and you can't remember this is actually a real thing this is called exercise brain so that was halfway if you can't remember 10 seconds remember you can come to that upright position five okay down we go x crunches opposite side so if you're stood up opposite side Five seconds. Three, two, one. If you're with me, knee out, toe out, knee. So we're really working across the core. This is our last one before a rest. Ten seconds. So keep 
that pivot. Hands are high in line with the face. Breathe. You're going as quickly as you can. Come on. 15 seconds. Let's go. 10. Keep it up. 5. 3. 2. 1. Now, we know these ladder press ups are going to be pretty tough now. Come on down. 5 seconds. 3, 2, 1. We go. Come on. Get low. So you know your options. Bring your knees in. Use the wall. Come on. Doesn't matter where you are. We are all getting stronger. Come on. 10 seconds. See, so even Zan's on his knees. I don't know when it happened. I didn't clock it. Okay, up and down. Jab, cross, other side. So opposite foot forward. <laughs> Zan's forgetting now. Five seconds. Three, two, one, if we go. Come on, guys. Let's go quick. Come on. You're going to stay with it. 20 seconds. I know. Arms are tired. 15. Come on. Let's go. 10. Pick it up with me. Come on. Five. Two. One. Woo. Smooth the arms around. Okay, last two exercises at repeating. Ball throws. So you're going to grab your imaginary ball. Reach up. Come down. Pick it up. Up. Down. Off we go. So if you want to, you can hop down. Come on, keep it going. Let's go. We're only going to do these once. I said we were repeating, but I was wrong. Three, two, one. Plank jack to finish. So come down to the mat. This is the last one. Hands underneath the shoulders. You're going to hop out and in. Three, two, one, off we go. You can always step. It's our last bit of work. Come on. Keep your shoulders over your wrists. Keep breathing. 10 seconds, let's go. Three, two, one. Come on down. Good job, guys. So, high five to you. I'm not going to touch him, he's too sweaty. You can have my towel there. <laughs> so, I was going to grab a quick drink and then we're going to cool on down. You're going to reach your right fingertips up to the sky, wiggle your fingers, and then they're going to come underneath. So under the bridge, bring your shoulder down if you can, and then ear down to the mat. And I'm really actively pushing away my left hand. So it should feel really good down the side, through your shoulder. Okay, come to center. Other side, so breathe in, left fingertips up. Breathe out, come on under the bridge. Really push your right hand into the floor. Shoulders down, hands down if you can. Okay, come to center. You're gonna take a child's pose, so toes together, knees nice and wide. Bum comes back to your heels. Fingertips are gonna reach up, you're gonna tent the palms. So I'm up on my fingertips. Breathe in, look forward, breathe out, chin to chest. 
Breathe in, look forward. Breathe out, chin to chest. Now, if you can, bring your forehead to the mat. Hands are going to come down. Really reach your fingertips forward for that good stretch. If you want a bit more of a stretch through the arms, bring your palms together up behind your head and then walk your elbows forward. So you're going to feel that down the backs of your arms. Breathe here, so heart rate should be coming down now. Okay, hands come forward. We're going to step one foot up, doesn't matter which. Come into a nice low lunge, so come on to the foot at the back. I'm just going to come hands up onto your hips if you can. Sink nice and deeply into that front leg. Now, if this is too much through the hip flexor, you're going to walk your knee forward a little bit. Okay, curl the toes under at the back, fingertips to the mat, toes come up towards the nose as we come back, take a runner stretch. So I'm just gonna move so you can see better. So breathe in, look forward, breathe out. Nose over to the knee. So Zen was saying about his hamstrings being tight. <laughs> Here is a stretch for your hamstrings. Okay, we're going to change legs, so opposite foot forward. First, we're going to take that low lunge. So, foot flat on the floor at the back. You're going to come up, really lead into this. So, if this is too much through the back hip flexor, just bring your knee forwards. Deep breaths. So, really good job today, guys. I mean, it's typical that the sun comes out. <laughs> okay, fingertips down. Toes up towards the nose, come back, breathe in, look forward, breathe out, round over. So hips are square, do not sit back, resist that temptation, you're not going to feel it so much in your hamstring. So you guys, I'm just going to plug my Monday class, so that's on YouTube live, strength and mobility. So we do lots of active stretching in that class, so a really good one for everybody, doesn't matter. Whether you're into cardio, resistance training, whatever you're into, it's great for everyone. Okay, come on through. We are done, and however you want to finish. Thank you so much for joining us on a Saturday morning. Like I said, if you came in late, you can um, go and come and do this later. So I'm going to put it on my IGTV and on my YouTube. Thank you so much, and. I will see you on Monday. Remember, these are all free donation, free classes, but if you want to donate, you can do that via the website. So, please, fitness.com. Thank you and enjoy the rest of your weekend.